welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a vlog where I go shopping for my car essentials and there will also be a haul at the end of the video where I show you everything that I bought today. The shops that I'm planning to go in are B&M, Halfords and possibly Wilco's just to have a look at what they've got and get some little essentials and accessories for my new car. If you don't already know I have a Fiat 500 Pop and I'm going to get some car accessories for it because I'm so excited. I got it relatively recently like literally a couple of weeks ago and I'm so excited to get some accessories and to decorate it and basically make the car more personalized to me so without further ado let's go into town and I'm gonna be meeting my friend and we're gonna go shopping I'm here with Olivia we're just down the car care aisle although this does not look much like car care to me oh here we are look what have we got all bike stuff. Oh, this is bike stuff. This is car stuff. Phone holder, but well, I, I want to get a, a car. <laughs> air compressor. <laughs> no, I don't want to get a phone holder from here. I'll get it from Halfords because. Do you mind? Because I want to get a good one that's not going to like fall off, you know? Right. We're in B&M, by the way. I don't know. If, I don't think I told you. I don't actually remember what I've got already. So, microfiber cleaning kit might be handy. Yeah. Looking for a container for the back behind my seat. Look, it says sparkle on it. What do we think? Just the wrong side. What do we think about that? I don't think it's deep enough. Do you know what I mean? I feel like things are gonna fall out. Maybe. I just want like I'm oh, gonna put in it. I don't know. I think these ones might be better because they're like deeper up there. And I was thinking and putting in stuff like that you like if someone comes in my car like if you come in the car and i, I oh. n you need something so like sweets and like other stuff like that i can't i like that one that's a good size they do it in white don't they we have just left b and m and it was like semi successful i mean i got quite a lot of things i liked a basket full of stuff i'm not going to show you right now because i'll show you when i do the haul when we get back but we're now heading to Halford and we probably won't have time for like Wilco's and that but we might have to quickly rush around because I need to get some food from Sainsbury's for this video I'm doing like tomorrow or no not tomorrow next week I also wanted like a tripod I thought a tripod for my phone and a tripod for my camera could be quite cool uh, because then I can film drive with me's and stuff like that in the future the oh yeah and a scraper for scraper for ice and snow and all that on the windows but i'll see you what they've got and i'll show you okay we're in halfords now and we're just looking at the different like car tripod kind of things we've got the cable this one here eight pound it's a red and black one because it'll match the car these are the own brand which should be okay anyway and then we've also got these ones which is a really good brand i know that's good that's 16 pound for that one but we'll see i'm not sure which one to get yet bye olivia we have, I can take this off now. We have been in Wilco's, Halford, Sainsbury's and B&M today and we actually got some good bits. I've got some good bits for my car, happy with what I've got and I think I've got just about everything now so we're doing well and I cannot wait to show you everything I got in a haul when I get home. I am home and I've got my basket of goodies quite literally and I cannot wait to show you everything I got for my car. I'm so excited and I cannot wait to decorate my car, put all these things inside and also do give you guys a car tour very very soon. I haven't really filmed any other car videos yet because I've been waiting to film this vlog where I go out and buy all of the accessories and things before I do any of the other videos which will be coming soon such as decorating and personalising my car and a car tour video and I cannot wait for the car tour absolutely buzzing about it so without further ado let's just show you what I did get today for my car the first thing I got for my car was this Belkin bone tripod now I know that this is a really good brand for car accessories because my mum and John both have this brand in accessories for their car and they have this exact car mount actually and I know that it's really good it stays on the window so well and I didn't want to buy a really cheap one because I wanted one that was good quality wasn't going to rattle around wasn't going to fall off um, and I don't want it to be distracting while I'm driving so I'm very happy that I got this one and it was £16 I got it from Halfords and I don't think that price is too bad at all really for the quality of it anyways 
and this is also really good because it comes with an adapter so if you want to stick it on your dashboard instead of the window then you can do that and obviously I'll see what I find more convenient and useful um, once I'm used to driving the car a bit better but I thought I would get this and I'm very excited and fingers crossed I'll be able to film some car drive with me videos soon. I'm hoping to also get a camera tripod as well for when I'm a bit more experienced with driving and I can do some drive with me videos and I I cannot wait to do that. The second thing I got were these lovely jumbo multi-purpose cloths and these are the like microfiber ones which is really really good because you don't want to get cloths that are going to scratch all your surfaces so I got this four pack and they were three pounds and they're really big ones like they're bigger than normal so I don't even see how big they are but they go from like there to there like they're really long and I thought I would keep this grey one in my car and also this grey one because yellow is not really going to match my car and I don't think I already mentioned but I have a red Fiat 500 and so the yellow is not really going to go with it so I'm planning on keeping in my car this one with the love hearts because I thought that was absolutely adorable and then the just the plain grey one as well and I thought that'd be really cute to keep in the side pockets of my car or in the glove box just to wipe everything down when it's getting a little bit dusty. I can't remember if I just said that those cloths were from B&M. I think I did but they were from B&M if I didn't already say. This is from Wilco's and this is a mini travel first aid kit so it's absolutely tiny as you can probably see and I thought this would be perfect to put, either put in my glove box or to put in this basket which is going to go behind the passenger seat of my car. Although I do have a bigger one that's going to be in the boot and it's going to have more stuff in it I thought it'd be handy to have a smaller one just to have nearby in case I just need it quickly in an emergency which hopefully I won't need to use this but I thought it'd be good to have it just in case and I want to say this was like four pounds four pound fifty from Wilco's which is really not bad at all and you get like plasters bandages all sorts in it in fact should we have a quick look inside and I can show you what you get in it okay so inside you get plasters dressings self-adhesive dressings um, a crepe bandage or crepe, I'm not sure. Microporous tape, antiseptic wipes and safety pins in this one. So you do get quite a decent amount of stuff, which is really, really good just to have with you. So here we've got the dressing pads and the greys plasters. And then we've got some of the bandage. And yeah, just loads of different things in there, which should come in handy if I ever need it. But fingers crossed, I won't need to use this. And something a little bit similar, I did actually get some more plasters and I know it seems a bit excessive but you just never know and I actually have a baby sister and obviously as she grows up I'm probably going to be giving her lifts to and from places, I don't know, to nursery or taking us to the park or something and you know little kids get a lot of grazes and bumps and scratches so I thought it'd be good to have some plasters in the car with me. You get 40 in here, all different shapes and sizes and I thought that's just better be safe than sorry. I got some extra spearmint gum or spearmint. I'm really not sure how you say it. This is one of my favourite flavours. I love cool mint, I love bubble mint and then the spearmint one as well and I thought this would fit perfectly in the cup holder in my car so just grab a piece of gum if I want some which I often do. I absolutely love gum so this is really handy and I got this from Wilco's. I think it was relatively cheap but you do get 60 pieces in it which should last me quite a long time. Also from Wilco's I got some Mawams. I mean everybody loves Mawams and I thought this would be fantastic to have in the back of the car. I'm going to keep it in this basket so then if I ever have any passengers in the car with me who are hungry or if I myself, which I will probably be really, really hungry, if I am hungry then I can just grab one of these snacks because I thought it gives me a bit of energy, it's got a bit of sugar and they're also delicious. I mean, I love my arms so I thought it would be perfect to have in my car. Then from B&M I got some Clean and Protect Antibacterial Multipurpose Cleaning Wipes and these kill 99.9% .9 of bacteria, which I thought was really good, especially at the moment. Hopefully coronavirus won't be staying for too much longer, but I did think it was a good idea to have these anyways, because these are for all surfaces. I can wipe down surfaces if they're getting a bit dusty or dirty, if there's a spillage or anything, these would just be perfect. And also to wipe like my steering wheel or something, if coronavirus is still around, or if it's cold and flu season, and I wanna just wipe my steering wheel quickly before I get in, or the door handles or something, then that'll be um, a good thing to have, so. I got these and these were pretty cheap. I can't remember how much they were, but I just know they were like 
only a couple of pounds. And then I got some more wipes from B&M and these are hand wipes. Again, kind of like a similar thing to the antibacterial wipes, just in case I do need these. Or if I ever break down or something and I have to sort out something that's like oily or dirty, then I can just wipe my hands with these. Cause obviously if I could use hand gel, but that's just gonna spread all the dirt around rather than actually wiping it off. So I thought these would be quite good. Also from B&M, I got some hand gel, just getting all the essentials in here. Obviously this is so important to have at the moment. And this is 70% of alcohol and it kills 99.9% .9 of bacteria. So again, important to have. And it's just a handy little bottle to stick in the car. And finally from B&M, we have this basket and I absolutely love this. It's this beautiful gray color. And as you've already seen in the vlog part, I couldn't decide whether to get pink or gray. And I just ended up going with gray in the end because the ceiling of my car is gray. It's kind of like a similar color to this, like a really pale, creamy gray. I thought this would probably go better with cream and red than pink because pink's gonna kind of clash with the red so I thought maybe not maybe get grey it's just quite subtle and it probably won't be that noticeable in the back of the car this was only four pounds from B&M which was really really good I love the design on it I think it's really pretty and my plan is to put this behind the passenger seat and put all my essentials in it that I just need in the car it'll be quick and easy to grab and if it's behind the passenger seat obviously I'll be in the driver's seat I can just quickly reach across and grab something from it and also if people are in the car they can have any essential that they need will be in this basket and this is the absolute ideal perfect size it's a decent size so I can fit a good amount of stuff in it but it's also not massive and really obvious but I just I just I just love it so much love this and the final two items were from Halfords so I got the USB car charger and this goes in the cigarette lighter because I don't actually have a USB plug in my car because it's a little bit older and then I also got the USB cable from Halfords and it's a lightning cable because obviously I've got an iPhone and it's a 1.2 meters I didn't actually need one quite this long there's only one shorter one and it was literally like this long it was like 15 centimeters and I thought well that's a little bit too short so I decided to get this one but this is really cool because it's red and black and my car is red and black so I was like that is absolutely perfect it's gonna match my car perfectly and this one is black so it's gonna actually look quite smart well it's gonna look as nice as these sort of things can be I mean they're not exactly the prettiest things in general but I made them as nice as they can be and hopefully my car will look quite cute with all the accessories I've bought that is everything that I did buy today for my car I am gonna be doing like I said a car tour soon so if I have bought any more things in the meantime then obviously I will show you in that video and i'm so excited to do all these car videos I, I, this is obviously my first car so this whole process is very very exciting for me it's kind of like moving house you know getting all your little accessories and just personalizing it and making it your own and i'm so excited i love all of the stuff i've got and I hope you guys enjoyed watching. If you do have a car, you've got a new car, or you're interested in Fiat, then do comment down below about your car. Let me know what you're excited about, your favorite product, or ask me any questions you want. You could also request some videos in the comments as well if you want that are to do with cars, because I'm gonna be filming so many soon because it's just a really exciting thing for me. And anyways, I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up, and I'll see you again soon. Lots of love, Spark Rewind. Hey, just before you go, please don't forget to subscribe it mean the absolute world to me we are getting closer and closer to 2,000 subscribers and it is so exciting so please subscribe it would make my day and stick around if you do want to see more car videos so thank you so much for watching i'll see you soon bye